Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Sorry I haven't posted anything in like forever but it was my boyfriend's birthday and I went down to his and he lives like a bit away from me so I'd say probably about two and a half, three hours away. Well he doesn't, he lives just a, like an hour away from me but his family are down south so we went down there and spent a couple of days and it was really awesome so that's why I haven't really posted anything. I didn't really have any time to put anything together before. I left, I didn't really think about it, I was just like Hang on a minute, probably should have done a video before I left, but what ifs, I'm here now. Uh, so in this video I'm just going to be give, giving you a brief update on my hair and how it's holding up. I've probably had this hair, I don't know, I don't know, let me, let me figure out how long have I actually had this hair. It should have been about a month, it should have been, I could be wrong, let's scroll through Instagram because that's how I'm going to know. 22nd of May, so basically just over a month. I think it's holding up pretty well. It's still pretty um, colourful. I haven't topped it up at all. I haven't re-dyed it or anything like that. It is a bit patchy in some places, so I will have to go in and, you know, give it a little, little spruce. It's still pretty soft, pretty tangle-free. It doesn't really knot up or tangle up a lot. It's getting there. It is getting a bit a bit tangly and it does shed a bit more that I have noticed but um, overall it's not it's not been too bad it's not been too bad I think it's still holding up the closure itself like the frontal is still laying quite flat I've decided to straighten it today as you've noticed I've had it curly or wavy since I first got this hair so now I've just decided let's let's try it straight let's try it straight so yeah when I curl or straighten I use about 185 degrees it might be still a bit hot I'm not entirely sure but I don't use the maximum like I used to be on the maximum like burn 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 you know like basically use Satan's tongue to straighten or curl my hair but I don't do it that hot anymore because it, it will last a bit longer as there are a few split ends not been too bad I have been applying just a little bit not too much of like coconut oil just things like that I'm pretty happy with how it's been after a month it's holding its own now to the dyeing part of it, as I have mentioned before, like obviously there is a bit of patches in it. I straightened it, but I didn't straighten it, straighten it. As you can see, it's still got a few kinks in it, but whatever. So I never have my hair bone straight. A few of you have asked, like, how it's holding up, and I would say so far out of 10, I'd probably rate it about 7 out of 10, really, because I don't like it when, it when I first get my hair done. I don't like how it feels because it, don't, it doesn't feel right I like it when it's got a bit of you know when it's getting a bit tangly a bit knotty because it's got more life to it it's it's been lived you know it's been through some things it's seen some things that's what I like but not seen too much it's not seen too much it's seen a little but not too much you know, it's been raining a lot here in England and that's probably why it's a bit bushy I gave I did give it a bit of a straighten just to try and tame it a little bit because if you'd seen it before you'd have thought I was like Black Amy Winehouse or something it was just Bush. It was a bush. We ain't got time for bushes on our heads, you know. Well, we ain't got time for bushes anywhere else either. I've noticed with this dye, it has gone to a silver. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's really weird, like this sort of lilac I can't remember what. I can't actually remember the, the name of the dye, but it has actually gone silver. But I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It kind of reminds me of Rogue from X Men, you know. I kind of, kind of like that that it's done that. I never went in and cut any layers or anything into it, but I think I might go in and pluck the front a little bit more, just so it lays a bit more natural when I put it back, because it is still pretty dense at the front. Yeah, I put some foundation just down the middle because I felt like it was looking a little too light for my head. So yeah, I don't even know what to say, this is just going to be one jumbled video, that is just the update on this hair so far, the one month update. I'll probably do a two month update so you guys can see how it's holding. I'll probably come back here looking like some sort of willow tree or something, I don't know. Come here looking crazy. Come here doing the Britney Spears, like yeah, I've had enough. But <laughs> we will see. But yeah, I hope I've answered a few of your questions about how this hair is holding up. I will post a link to where I got this hair again in the comment section. Comment section? In the comment section? In the description box below so you guys know where I'll purchase this hair from. Oh, before I go actually, I do feel like I'm gonna have to top this up because originally when I dyed this hair, I dyed it obviously, can't remember the colour, 
violet, I think it was, violet, pink, red, you know, and I don't think the red took too well. As you, I don't know if you can see, but it's a lighter pink than this one. So this took fantastically, the pink, but this was actually meant to be red. So I think I'll probably do a video and show you guys me actually trying to re-dye this red. Let's see if that will if that will work. It may be a fail, it may not be, but you're coming on the journey with me. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoy this video and this has given you an insight onto the lifespan of this hair. We're gonna we're gonna look after it from newborn to when it's time to lay it to rest. Because that's literally it. I don't think there's anything more I could possibly say about this hair. You know, I haven't oh I should know to the light, I haven't washed it as such yet either because that will make it fade but when I do wash it it will be a cold conditioner wash just conditioner cold water that's what I usually do and that's what helps keep this hair very vibrant anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you all in my next video bye